Tonight, another high-profile case related to Rhode Island social host law. That's right. The Attorney General's office announcing today state police are going to charge Governor Lincoln Chafee's son, Caleb, after an incident in May. Eyewitness News reporter Sean Daly is working the developing news tonight. He joins us now live outside the State House with the Providence Mobile Newsroom. Governor Lincoln Chafee's summer didn't begin well, and now it's not ending well either. In six seconds, Governor Lincoln Chafee revealed just how uncomfortable he was when this incident first happened. Very remorseful and 18-year-olds uh, getting in trouble and uh, don't have anything further to say. The governor was talking about a state police investigation of a high school graduation party that his 18-year-old son, Caleb Chafee, threw on the Chafee family farm in Exeter on Memorial Day. According to a state police report obtained by WPRO, an 18-year-old woman got so drunk she was hospitalized. Now, Caleb Chafee is charged with one count of violating Rhode Island's social host law. In a statement, the governor wrote, quote, Caleb will accept responsibility for his actions, and in addition to any legal consequences that result, we will continue to deal with this matter as a family. It's our hope that this event, however regrettable, has provided an opportunity for a dialogue about the dangerous and potentially harmful effects of underage drinking. Eyewitness News legal analyst Lou Polner. It's a $500 civil penalty, up to 30 hours of community service, and uh, the judge could uh, order, attend a program, an educational program about the dangers of alcohol. Both Governor Chafee and the state police chose not to go on camera in connection with this development. Live at the State House with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Sean Daly, Eyewitness News.